after successful installation of python 3 you might feel very awkward like you can type the command python 3 then space dash dash version and when you hit enter key or return key then you will see that the python is not there okay so what is the main reason of that basically let me show you the error first so here i type the command python and space dash dash version and i am getting the error that python is not recognized as an internal or external command operable program or batch file so in this tutorial we'll show you how to fix this thing before going to solve the issue let me tell you briefly what is the main reason of this error the main reason of this error is the python installation path uh, if your computer does not able to figure out what is the python location then uh, you might get this problem so the solution is pretty straightforward and very simple we just need to set up the environment variable of python from the environment variables control panel path so let's uh, figure out what is the actual location of python for my case i installed python in the default location that means i didn't change it uh, to other location so by default python will be installed on your c drive then under c there will be users uh, folder then we have to access there under users folder you have to figure out what is the computer name for my case the computer name is me so i am accessing the me folder once you are in the me folder then you have to type uh, manually app data okay in the top bar of this panel uh, and hit return key or enter key and then you have to go to the local folder after accessing local folder you have you will search uh, the folder it is called programs and under programs there will be python folder this is the main location where the python installation will be installed and under python uh, if we double click then we will access to the python and then the version number of our python so we need to access there once we access there uh, we'll see that is a python.exe file so that means this is the default installation location of python of my computer uh, you have to search your own default location of your computer where you install python uh, if you want to know the detailed installation uh, i have other video you can check uh, from my playlist uh, it will be very uh, easy and straightforward now we just need to copy this path because we need to set this path uh, in the environment variable section so i just copied this path and now i have to open the environment variable control panel so i am going to click on start menu and now i have to type env which means that I edit the system environment variable i just need to double click and then it will open system properties window we have to go to the advanced tab there will be a button it's called environment variables under the advanced tab we just need to click here to access the environment variables option and once you click there then the environment variable panel will be open and there will be two boxes upper and lower here we have to search path under system variables box panel once we find the path variable then we have to uh, search the button of edit there will be three button new edit delete so we need to go to the edit button uh, once we click on edit button it will pop up other window and from here we have to click on uh, new button and once we hit the new button and the new black line will be appeared and here we need to paste that path do you remember uh, the path of python.exe so i just paste it and then i have to click on ok button once i finish pasting the path uh, to set up that completely then again we have to go to the python installation folder uh, we also need to click on edit button again because we need to add uh, another path of the pip install location so i just clicked on the edit button and then i'm going to the uh, python install location and from here there will be a folder it's called scripts so we need to go to scripts and here we will see that pip.exe file is there so we also need this path also i'm just copying this path and uh, control plus c i copied the path and then i came to this environment variable control panel again and then i am going to click the new button again uh, to make a blank space and after that i am pasting that uh, copied uh, path of pip install location so finally we have to click on ok button to save these changes and then we have to click ok button to close this window in this way the primary uh, two things like python.exe and pip.exe these two uh, path location we can save and once we save then hit enter we can hit uh, ok button to save the changes so now let's on i want to note uh, one more thing it is that actually if you have multiple python install what to do so let's go to the python environment variable again uh, we are accessing uh, that path location panel again and then i'm clicking edit button if um, there are multiple versions of python is installed on your computer then you need to uh, change the order so for my case I see there are multiple versions of python are there like c python 
27 and there is python 38 so there are two basically versions of python is installed out there but i want the latest version of python so what i have to do i have to make the older version down to this list or we can also do other thing we can change the order of the latest version at the top of the list my plan is to put the old versions of python at the down of the list so that it will be easier uh, so i am selecting the old version and i'm going to click on move down button till it goes to the down i will continuously click there so i am doing that uh, once it is at the end of the list then we are fine uh, that means the recent version of python will be active here once we finish all the changes then we need to close uh, by pressing ok button and finally again ok button uh, to save the changes now we'll check whether that error is still exist or not so i am opening the command prompt and then i am typing the command uh, python then space uh, then dash dash uh, version once we hit the enter key after writing this then we will see that the python version is displayed over there that is 3.8.1 and and there is no error like python 3 is not recognized as internal or external uh, command operation program or best file something like that okay so in this way we can easily fix uh, the problem another thing if you want to open the python uh, interpreter then you can also type the command python uh, just simple python and then you can hit uh, the enter key of your keyboard then it will open the python where you can write the python commands and execute the commands so in this way you can easily fix the error which is the common error many people they face after python installation uh, i think after uh, following this tutorial you can easily fix the problem and if you have any issue or if you don't have to fix then put in the comment section uh, with details uh, and thank you for watching the video.